we are going to be having a look or should I say a listen to this mic this is the AK the Alkio AK80 microphone Before I begin this review, I just want to say that all of the audio you are going to be hearing in this video is going to be coming straight from this mic, this AK80 mic. Um, I'm not going to edit it in any way, or if I do, I will let you know when it is edited so that you can hear what it sounds like. But right now, out of the box, when you get the AK80 mic, you get the mic, you get the shock mount, you get the uh, windscreen, and you also get a cord in XLR to 3.5 millimeter cord. Right now I am not using that cord and I'll tell you why in just a bit, but I just want to say honestly I think this audio is really good. Uh, I'm really happy with the sound. I, I don't have a soundproof room. I'm right by the freeway so there's there is some background noise. Really quick I want you to hear what it sounds like if I do some editing in Audacity. There are two changes I like to make. The first is compressor. So here I will turn on the compressor here okay now this is the sound with the compressor turned on the other change I like to make is I will do some noise removal so here okay now the noise has been removed and, and I find uh, the compressor just makes the sound a little bit fuller and the noise removal uh, it removes noise uh, there is a problem with noise removal if you have a lot of noise it does still take out the noise but it also changes the way your voice sounds. So that's something you should be aware of if you want to do what I do in Audacity and do noise removal. I've turned off compressor and noise removal so this is the sound as it's coming straight from the microphone. One thing about a compressor mic like this is your setup really determines a great deal of how the sound is going to be. So I have an XLR to XLR cord and I have that plugged up directly into my audio interface that you can see here. I find that with this setup, I have a good sound. Uh, I have a large control over the gain. I'm able to get, I'm, I'm about a foot and a half from the mic here. If I get up to the mic, it's still really loud. So I can have the gain up really high. Uh, real quick, I want to change the setup for just a second so you can hear what it's like with the cord this comes with plugged into my audio interface. So I've got this XLR cord to 3.5 millimeter. This is what it comes with. So real quick, I'm going to unplug what I've got and plug this in so you can hear what it sounds like. So you can see that when I have it plugged into the XLR cord to the 3.5 millimeter cord, the gain is much lower. So for me to get the volume up, I I really have to be right up next to the mic, um, which this works for a lot of things, but for what I usually like to do, it's not preferable. Uh, real quick, I'm going to take the microphone out. Okay, so now that I have the microphone out, I want you to hear what it sounds like if you talk to the side or on top. The way I am talking, I'm speaking directly into the microphone. This is the preferred way to speak into it. If you speak from the side or the other side, it's not really that great. Or on top, it's not that great either. From the back, it's okay, but still, talking into the front I think is best. Okay, so I have this plugged back into the XLR cable, into the audio interface. I just want to say I really do think this is a great microphone. Like I mentioned before, a lot of it just depends on your setup and on your, if you have an audio interface or a sound card. Um, this, this does need external power, so you need phantom power or power from 
sound card or audio interface. If you just plug it directly into your computer, you're probably not going to get r good results. I know on my computer, it doesn't supply power to it, so you can't really hear anything. So you will need some sort of audio interface or sound card or phantom power or something like that to get sound from this microphone. But once you have the setup, it's perfect. You can swap out different mics for different things you want. I really like this AK80 mic. I use it a lot for my videos just because I can have it set up on my desk and running. And I think it sounds good. It has good gain when I use the audio interface and the XLR cord. Yeah, so overall, I am really happy with this mic. I think it sounds really good. Uh, you can set it up in different ways to get different sounds. Uh, I like the sound as is like this. I think it's a great mic.